Hey there, everybody. Thomas Wood with Basecamp Trading. Uh, we're going to take a look at the NASDAQ and one of the setups from the futures trading room today using the MTAM indicator, which stands for Multi Time Frame Analysis of Momentum. Uh, now, the way this indicator works, it's plotted down here at the bottom. And if it's looking at several different time frames, we're looking at a 15 minute chart, a 30 minute chart, a 120 minute chart. A 60 minute chart and a 240 minute chart. Okay, so we're looking at five different time frames. And it's plotting each one down here and it's referencing the momentum from each of those time frames. Now, green is bullish, blue is neutral, and red is bearish. However, when several of those time frames, when at least three of those time frames are lining up, it will give us a directional bias up here at the top and tell us, okay, we're bullish. So if you look here, we have a bullish breakout and then our MTAM changes to bullish. So we have bullish momentum on all five time frames green 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 like christmas tree and then you see what happens market continues or proceeds to rally straight up through the roof uh, we broke above resistance at 49.25 and a half and we went all the way up to a high of uh, 49.66 and a half so about 35 40 points uh, so not a bad rally so the thing you want to keep an eye on though is as long as your momentum continues to agree, you maintain a bullish directional bias. So we, we maintain bullish until right here where we go neutral. It's saying, okay, not all the time frames are lining up. We're not getting minimum number. Our min bias is not there. So we don't want to maintain a bullish outlook here. We're going to go to neutral. Then the very next bar goes, all right, we're going right back to bullish again. Okay, so we go right back to having bullish bias. And what this will do is it tells us shorter time frame charts we only want to be looking at long setups. We only want to be looking to take longs in this market. And we ignore short setups. What that'll do is it'll help keep you on the right side of the bigger breakouts and these bigger rallies that you get in the market, these big momentum shifts. All right, so keep an eye on that. This is again the MTAM indicator, stands for Multiple Time Frame Analysis of Momentum. It's coming out here in the next two weeks, uh, the week after Christmas, I believe, is when it's coming out. So, um, that's it. That's how you use MTAM or one of the ways of using MTAM. I will see you in the trading room bright and early tomorrow morning. And until next time, happy trading.